Sony is going to let us pre-order the PlayStation VR Core bundle after all. You see, the PlayStation VR launch bundle is available for pre-order today, and Sony originally said this $500 package would be the only one on sale early. But thanks to feedback from rad people like you, yes, you, 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 and even you there, eating Doritos and ready to complain about the division, the company will open up the $400 PlayStation VR bundles for pre-order on Tuesday, March 29th. Very nice. Believe it or not, Halo 2 originally had a pretty clean resolution instead of one of the biggest cliffhangers in video game history. Former Bungie composer Marty O'Donnell revealed to us here at IGN the original ending for the Xbox shooter sequel, stating that the ending was you and the dervish chasing the prophet of truth through the arc and having a grand and glorious conclusion on Earth, finishing the fight right there. But obviously that didn't happen, and honestly, I really don't know if Master Chief will ever actually finish the fight, with Halo 5 releasing last year and 6 probably on the way in the next couple of years. Well, it might not happen because of politics, blurg. Psyonix is ready for PlayStation 4 and Xbox One players to face off against each other in Rocket League. The studio's vice president, Jeremy Dunham, told GameSpot, Technologically, everything works. We've got it figured out. Just a little bit of time to get everything up and running. Right now, excitement is the best way to put it. We just want to get in there and make it happen. Come on, Sony and Microsoft, let's cross streams already. I mean, it worked out just fine for the Ghostbusters. Evolution Studios, the team responsible for PlayStation racing goodness like Drive Club and MotorStorm, is no more. Sony has confirmed with GameIndustry.biz that it's closing the studio. Drive Club game director Paul Raczynski took to Twitter and thanked fans, Sony, and his co-workers, saying, I hope you all will join me today in celebrating Evolution by picking up a pad, throwing on your favorite Evo game, and giving us a victory lap. We can definitely do that, and we here at The Fix also hope everyone at Evolution lands on their feet quickly. And that's your Daily Fix for March 22nd. I'm Naomi Kyle. Make sure you download our official IGN app to get more news and coverage. And remember to get your fix anytime online at IGN.